Florida, we ban Zuckerbucks, we ban ballot harvesting, we have a transparent process where you know the votes are coming in. When the election's over at 7 o'clock at night, you know how many votes have been cast, the results are, are, are produced. And I think a lot of people were frustrated because in 2020, and we've seen it in 22, you'd have votes cast, you'd have results uh, come up, tentative results, and then a week later, it would change. In California, it's like multiple weeks where that would happen. That does not inspire confidence, and so we need to do it the way Florida does it. But here's the thing. As the candidate, uh, I am not going to fight with one hand tied behind my back. If there is ballot harvesting, uh, we are going to harvest if it's allowed. I don't think it should be, but in Nevada and these places, we're going to get after it. We're going to have organizations that get every vote. If you have Zuckerbucks that's allowed, I think it's totally corrupt to allow it. It should be banned, but it's not banned in every place. And so if it's not, we're going to get after it. And we will absolutely, as president, ensure that you do not have federal agencies colluding with social media companies uh, to stifle information like they did with the Hunter Biden laptop. Uh, so let's be honest about the failings that happen, um, and let's make sure that we correct that going forward like we did in Florida.